Have you ever wondered how your phone still gets Wi-Fi even when you're in your room, far from the router and with walls in between? Imagine wireless signals as invisible waves, a bit like how sound moves through the air. When you shout in one room, sometimes people in the next room can hear you, even if there's a wall in between. That's because sound waves can travel through some materials, though they get weaker as they go. Wireless signals, like those from Wi-Fi or radios, are made of tiny energy waves called electromagnetic waves. These waves are much smaller than sound waves and can pass through many materials, including wood, drywall, and even bricks. However, not all walls are equal. Thicker walls, or ones made of metal, can block or weaken these waves more. That's why signals might get weaker or slower in some parts of your house. The waves are strong enough to go through most obstacles, but they lose a bit of their strength with each wall they pass. So, next time you watch a video in your room, remember, invisible waves are working hard, bouncing and squeezing through walls just to reach you. Subscribe to my channel to see more. Thanks.